occasionally we're asked how to increase or decrease the size of a project. So I'm going to show you how to do that. Now first thing we need to do is open up one of the files from one of the kits that we're interested in actually increasing the size of. So I'm going to go to File, Open, and I'm going to go ahead and begin by importing one of the first files. Okay, so here's one. This is from a Halloween lantern. Okay, so basically what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to import all of the files that correspond to this specific project. In this case, there will be nine. In other cases, there will be less, and it's possible that there may be more. So for the sake of this demonstration, I'm just going to go ahead and um, open them, open just a few of them up. Uh, the, the process is going to be the same no matter how few or how many files you have. There's actually two ways of doing this. And the method that I recommend that I think is going to be easier is by simply adjusting the percentage of the files. Okay, so in this case, I have this piece here, I have it highlighted, and we're going to go into the scale window. Okay, so we're going to open up the scale window, and as you can see here, there's an option for a percentage. So let's say that we want to only make this at 80% of its size. So we're going to type in 80% and hit apply. Actually, well, you don't want to do 80% twice. You only do it want to do it once. Okay? And then basically, you repeat that same percentage for all of the other files. Okay? So we're going to shrink that 80% and we're going to shrink this one 80%. Okay? So again, uh, you're basically going to repeat that process as many times as necessary until you have every single piece downsized or upsized by a specific percentage. Now another way of doing this, and let me go ahead and just close these. You can go to File, Open, and we'll need to open one file at a time here. And again, for the sake of this tutorial, I'm just going to open up three of the nine files. Okay, so let's just get three of them going. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to highlight this, and I'm going to go to Edit, and I'm going to hit Cut. And I'm going to go back one tab onto this page and hit Paste. Okay, so now we have two of the three pieces on the same mat. I'm going to go back and I'm going to grab this. I'm also going to cut this and then paste it here. Okay, so it looks like a giant mess. But what we're going to do is we're going to do an Edit, Select All. So now everything is selected and you have one handle that will allow you to increase and decrease all of these at the same time, which means that we're also decreasing them all by the same proportions, which means that we can either make it bigger or smaller and everything ultimately when it's cut will fit together properly. Okay, so this is just another way of doing what I demonstrated before using the percentages.